Sometime within the small hours of night and day. The lonely hours that before meeting we had separately frequented, you now lay on lust-scented sheets. Stared with the vulnerability of a boy. Hands gripped flesh like a newly unwrapped toy you did not want to share, you sighed. Gazed into my eyes, said, you'd never felt like this before. And though spoken with pure sincerity, the disparity between my emotional inclination and logical deliberation prevents me from receiving this as fact. Still, I smiled back at you. With gratitude, I replied I too had never felt like this. I've never felt more at one with anyone. Gone is the desire to keep myself alone. I'm more at home in your house than I am in my own. I've never known two people to be so in sync. If I am ying, then you are ying. We think so familiar. I recognize your thoughts. I know I haven't felt like this before. But I have said those words before to other men. And I meant it when I said it then. What I said to you, I said to them. So maybe I have felt like this. But it is through broken windows that I look back. Rose-tinted vision can romanticize the past, but splintered glass can alter facts and turn old lovers to enemies. And now I have a thousand smiling photos and no happy memories. Was it Therapy to erase the good parts whilst I was mending? Rewrite the start to match the ending? Have you forgotten the girl that you once loved? Or are you just pretending that her eyes and her lips and her soft flesh pressed beneath your fingertips did not once upon a time make you feel just like this when you kissed her? and called each other pet names? Was her laughter unfulfilling? Was it just not quite the same? See, I'm reluctant to believe you. Am I really that special, or do your memories deceive you? They change with time. Memories are facsimiles of things gone by. You cannot replay them. You can only recall. So how can you be sure you haven't felt like this before? Look, I know that you meant it. But we edit our story every time we tell it, and the present truth becomes malleable as it moves to past tense. What we remember is distorted by subsequent events and though sensibility to test its sense suggests it is a likely possibility that you'll look back and wonder what you ever saw in me. One day, in the small hours where we now frequently meet, you will lay on lust-scented sheets and stare with the vulnerability of a boy Hands grip flesh like a newly unwrapped toy you do not want to share and sigh. Gaze into someone else's eyes and say you've never felt like this before. <laughs>